Good morning, boys. Welcome back to the channel and another FC24 video. So, Golazo Pum, which just ended a couple of days, I mean, yesterday, and the team of the season warm up series is the latest promo in game. So, we've got, I believe, two weeks. That's just based on my assumption of the uh, daily team season SPC. Um, so, what I thought I would do is uh, give you a run through of my current squad before team season starts so that in that so that as you include a few cards up to the latest promo including a few colazo cards so let's just pop straight into the um club yeah and just, let's just dive straight into it okay so as we head into the club this is what my main rtg squad is looking like i've got athenea at right wing really active uh Karim benzema who's still in my starting 11 the 1900 Fantasy FC Gulli. We've got Team the Year Icon SPC uh, Hamare Sawa at uh, right DM, uh, Haji at central cam, left DM. We've got the uh, Evo the uh, Cassier, and of course, everyone's here favorite SPC of the year, uh, Vitolina Rolfo at left back. Then we've got uh, Adnyamada Vidic. Uh, I am doing the Golazo Evo, so that's why it looks like that. And then I did manage to pack um, Team of the Year Renard, as you can see, untradeable, first owner, and then the Kafu SPC, and as well as I, I did pack um, Team of the Year Check as well. So both these lads, when their cards were in packs, I did pack them at the time of the promo, promo going live. And the bench here, yeah, Harry Kuehl, I did manage to pack him from an 83 times 10 or an 84 times 7 i don't remember then Viali as well first pull so my whole squad during any fifa is to run a whole first owner squad i never buy players unless i am popping them them popping them in spcs and then the completed um Kolomwani finished almost a week ago i think or shorter than that um We've got Stanway's upgraded card as well on the bench. Park Ji Sung, who is pretty cheap. I haven't tried him in game yet, but he makes it onto my bench. And the upgraded Scott. And Kohler as well, who I did manage to pack, and I did pop him in the um, Evo. And he's a pretty beastly center back with mad defending stats, mad physicals with 92 stamina, 95 strength, 99 aggression, and good pace as well. So. Just for the sake of the Evo, he makes it out of my starting 11. But that is my team for now, guys. Um, I did complete the Haji SPC a few days ago. And the reason I wanted to do him is because one of my favorite playstyles in this game uh, are the um, Finesse Shot and the Dead Ball Plus. Uh, when the game initially started, I did have James Madison's Player of the Month SPC and he had Dead Ball uh, card on him, trade on him rather. So, but it when it comes to either the corner kicks or free kicks, it's a no-brainer. And this Haji is 5 star, 5 star, so he, he gets mad stats uh, in all those areas. And yeah, with regards to scoring traits, he's got all of them except power header. He's got insisted passes, which is not too bad. And with the 5 star, 5 star, so even, um, so I believe he is right foot, let me just check, left footed. So if you get the ball onto his left foot, you go for a finish shot from outside the box, it's obviously going to go in. So, um, before Hachi, I did have a player, a uh, Spanish lassie, in my starting 11 called Claudia Pina. And she was a banging car as well. Uh, she was an SPC. I think she required an 85 and an 87 rated squad, if I'm not mistaken. And yeah, she played around 500 plus games with me, 4 star, 5 star. So, Skill, I'm not really, I don't really use skill moves that much. I mean, it's not a massive plus for me. It's more of the weak foot. Of course, I do dribble here and there, but for me, it's the weak foot. And she was a banger because um, she had the um, finesse shot plus as well. So, uh, so for me, one of the greatest traits in the game are play styles that are the finesse shot plus, which I use massively. So the only thing that let her down was her stamina, which is 82. So she would get me up to the, I would say, 60 70th minute mark without having much of a fuss and my goat of my club is uh Karim Benzema radioactive he's played what 967 games 967 goals with 408 assists and only a single yellow card he's four star four star i did pop a hunter on him um if you do have him you could probably use an engine 
or if you're planning to use any variant. Of course, the foot birthday is much better. He's got improved agility and balance and stam as well. But even though this card is 85 rated stamina up, it doesn't feel like he's got 85 stam. He, I, I don't really honestly have to pull him out of the game unless I feel it. So he goes until the 80th, even 90th. Okay, 80, 82nd minute and pretty good. So with him, uh, with he's got 90 shooting, um, what 93 shot power, 99 finishing. So with the finish shot on him, he gets me a hat trick almost every single game. And that's the same with Hachi. So if I'm having a good game, these two with the finish shot plus just belt me goals, left hand setup. And with Sawa, uh, even though Sawa's got what 80 physical with the shadow on her, she's got 90 plus def pace, 90 plus defending. So she is a banging DM. And if you do take a corner, uh, it lands on her outside the box, go for a power shot or just shoot it at almost 80% power and she belts it to the back of the net. And since she's got press proven and relentless plus, so one of my other favorite playstyles is relentless plus because with that on your player and if your player has got around 95, 90, top 90 stats, they're basically got 99 stamp for the rest of the game. So you don't really have to take them out plus after the first time their stamp gets replenished. So that's the reason why I've got even Kafu at right back as well. He's one of the players I've always wanted to pop in from FIFA 23, FIFA 22. So the fact that I've got both of these guys in my defensive um, areas and Kafu's got relentless plus as well. So same thing for Sawa. His stamp gets replenished after the first half and he's basically at 99 stamp for the rest of the game. So this is what my current squad is looking like. It's pretty good. And we've got Atenea at... Um, Left rank who's got 5 star, 5 star, 90 stats across the game, across the board, 92 pace, 92 shot, 85 passing, 92 dribbling, and 79 physical is not too bad, but she does have 92 stamina, so pretty, uh, I'm pretty satisfied with this game, with this um, starting 11. If we go into the club, uh, let's just reset this, uh, concepts off, yep. So let me just take you to a few of my high rated players. So we have the SBC Kane. I regret completing, but after I pack honorable mentions Kane, I realize this Kane is 4 star, 5 star, whereas the SBC is only 3 star, 5 star. So aside from that, the stats are nearly identical. Uh, we have a pack pulled first donor, Dennis Burkamp. He was in my starting 11 for quite a while till I got in uh, Sawa. We got the upgrade in Mahajri, player of the month, Lewandowski. Who else have we got? We've got uh, the Queen Patrice Juero. Apologies for belting her last name. Um, I was considering uh, popping her into the Evos, but I'm not going to give EA FC points. I spent so, thousands of hundreds of thousands of coins just for plus two um, in the upgrade. So, yeah. Uh, aside from that, we've got the end of an era Hugo Lloris. We've got the SPC Lautaro Martinez. We've got Bobby Moore. I am completing the Makaleli and Beckham SPC squad, so I'll take you through there later. Upgraded Aspas, base SPC Henri, uh, the upgraded Orban, future star Shevchenko and Canavara, Canavara rather, um, back pull Rosiski, the objective Alonso who expired yesterday, uh, the royal line in the club there, uh, back pull Francesco Coli, back pull. Uh, Gunduan as well from my foot champs rewards a couple of weeks ago. Who else have we got? Uh, gosh, loans off. My bad. Um, okay, much better. Uh, we got Winter Wildcards and Cuckoo pack pulled up. And Cuckoo was a decent card for me. He wasn't overpowering as a starting 11, probably as a sub. He'd be a good shout out. Um, we've got the objective Jaka, pack pulled Ederson, upgraded maxed. Politano, 90 Les Melu, 90 Adley as well. He was an objective as well. Banging card. The Insigne um, season objective card. Player of the month, Ibala. Rose Level Pack. Uh, objective Small, sorry, SPC Small Arec. Apple Brolin was pretty cheap as well. Uh, SPC Goretzka. Sorry, uh, Evo Goretzka, Evo Bernardo Silva. Evo Correa, Objective and Percy, Evo Varane and Ronaldo, Evo Din 
in Bembe. Um, I packed Law Drop as well as an untradeable card. Yep, pretty good. Uh, the baby Berbatov and Stoichkovs. A few player of the month there. So a couple of decent icons in there. A lot of foot birthday cards. Uh, yeah, I mean, foot birth ultimate birthday rather. Those are pretty banging uh, promos. So a lot of ultimate birthday cards in there. A couple of Evos. Uh, just a right card. Blanc. DVD, gold rated, untradeable, first donor, a couple of good uh, high rated informs, um, Gold Sala, who was a beast when the game initially started, and yeah, with that finesse plus in there, he was a banging card for me. Packpool Trailblazers, Schwa Cancelo, and the list goes on. So I've got a decent club uh, with a decent amount of fodder in there. So hopefully, um, as team season warm up, progresses we can pack a few good informs hopefully so if i go to the favorites i've popped in some back some growth up so with regards to a whole icon squad uh, i'm only lacking a left back with some growth up, so no problem to complete there we have the under spc left to complete i mean it's an 81 rated squad with an inform so it won't take much time um kai series so he's not bad so initially what i do is when the game initially starts EA always, whether it's in the milestones or SPCs, have as the VC League of Portugal players in there, so and they're relatively cheap, so it's always um, a fun squad to run. And like I said, Makaleli, we've got the last two 88 scores left to complete on him. Marcus, the last two, the 86 and 87. Rex, the last 88, and Hidetoshi Nakata, an 87 rated squad, coming around 70k, so it's not too bad. We've got 1.1 mil in the squad, in the club rather. So I am going to hold on for a few coins, either use them in SPCs and yeah, see what the game takes me. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up, drop a comment. Most importantly, turn this notification bells on for future content. Hopefully you liked the video guys and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.